Hello family, it's your girl Nisha Speaks and I am back with another video. Um, I've got a great one lined up for you. It's all about fragrance. As you can see, some of my favorite fragrances for the new season. Um, spring is coming and I've got you covered on what you need to get to have you smelling amazing. Um, but before we get into that, I would really love and appreciate if you would go ahead and click that subscribe button right down there. And also, uh, go ahead and click the bell so that you can get all the notifications um, of when I post new videos so you don't miss a thing. Okay, let's get started. Okay, so we all know that winter is ending and spring is coming and everything is supposed to be coming alive, springing up, growing, lively, floral, being wonderful and amazing. Um, so I've got these fragrances here that will put you in the mood for all things new, all things growing, all things um, beautiful. Um, it's really just, you know, if you have some things that you use in winter, Go ahead and transition those things out as well as I'm going to do a video, I think, of the smells that I use for my home and then transitioning them into something more bright, get ready for spring and summer. Um, so I'll probably have that video up soon too. But today it's all about our body. Okay, so this is a really quick video. I've got one, two, three, four fragrances that we're going to talk about. First, let's talk about body care, right? So um, this one I love is from Bath and Body Works and it is Oahu Coconut Sunset. I've been using this for a few years now for spring and summer and um, I really, really love it because I am not a flower really, flower girl, you know, the floral, rosy kind of scent or whatever. So this is really right up my alley. It's very coconut-y. <laughs> it just kind of smells like summer, like you have, you've been sun-kissed and um, it's really good. The keynotes or what it smells like. So when I say keynotes, the notes of the scent, um, it is, let's see, coconut blossom. Sparkling Bergamot, Beach Tuberose, um, Hawaiian Ma Manoi, and Molten Amber. So I have the um, shower gel as well, and I have that, you know, of course, in the shower. But this is the um, Shea and Vitamin E Body Lotion. And this one is the hand, um, I use it, I put this one in my purse. So um, for my hands and elbows and stuff so that I'm not, you know, whatever. And um, it's the Ultra Shea Body Care. It's thicker. This one is thicker than than this. This one has a more potent um, fragrance or smell. And this is uh, a bit thicker, more moisturizing. And then they have the body spray. So I use this um, every day when I shower. I use the body uh, soap. Bought shower gel for, you know, the shower and everything. And um, I just lotion up with this. Um, spray down with this and I'm good to go on that. It really, really um, smells really good and I love it. And people compliment me all the time during spring and summer um, about this fragrance. And that's with this just alone, um, with this line alone. So you can get this at Bath and Body Works. Um, it's not a retired fragrance. Um, you can probably still find it. I <laughs> ordered, I, when I ordered it, I think I they had the semi-annual sale. And so I stocked up on this. I think I have like three of the three of each um, of these things so I don't run out. So you might want to do that. I don't know, just me. So that's body care. That's what I use. It really smells good. Um, if you guys want to do like a hygiene video about like, you know, I, I see a lot of people doing that. Um, and it kind of does make a difference what you bathe with and then what you put on for that. But I might contemplate doing a hygiene video. Probably not. I don't know. Okay, but on to this. Now, this is, uh, oh, smells really good. Um, it's Coach Signature Perfume. And, um, it's very light and very, uh, uh, fragrant and flirty. Um, and very feminine. It's very, very feminine. And um, I get so many compliments from men um, when I wear this. It, I mean, it's just like, I'm like, oh, okay, yeah. So, um, you know, oh, you smell so good, niche. You know, whatever. But it's <laughs> it smells so good. 
Um, it's very, very light. And I wear it in the daytime um, when I'm going to work or whatever. Uh, along with this, so then I just do this on my pulse points. Um, so that would be my wrist, my neck, and my heart. And so that's where I put this fragrance. And the notes for it are guava, jasmine, mimosa, turbo rose, which is the same that's in this. So it's kind of together. Um, vanilla and amber wood. So it's kind of, um, it's very light. It's not floral at all. It's just, oh, it just smells so good. It just smells really good and it works well with my natural body um, chemistry. And um, it lasts all day. Oh, along with this, this lasts a long time. So um, you put this on your body and you may re-up, you know, after you wash your hands from the bathroom or whatever, and then it kind of rejuvenates the fragrance, but it does last, and this one lasts all day. Um, it costs, you know, so. Though I think, well, I'm not gonna say, I was gonna say that sometimes the more expensive the perfume, the longer it lasts, but that's not true because some of the cheap stuff um, lasts a long time too. So, moving on from, this one is Coach Signature. Um, I really, really love it. It works really good for me. And you will get a lot of attention um, fragrance-wise if you purchase that. So that smells good and it doesn't compete or whatever. You know, it, all that blends perfectly. Okay, so moving right along. Uh, the next one is this beauty here. I love this bottle. It's so um, sleek and so pretty. It's called C S I uh, C Passionate. Passione, I think that's how you say it. Um, it's by Giorgio Armani, and it is so not me at all. It's like, this is, I don't even know why I chose this, but <laughs> it's really not my style at all, but I needed a nighttime fragrance for when I go out at night. Um, and this is very dark. It's very husky, musky, um, spicy scent. And I'm not a spicy girl at all, but that's what that smells like. Um, it's very feminine, like, uh, femme fatale type, you know, that's the kind of, kind of fragrance this is to me, you know, I may be a weirdo, I don't know, but it's very, um, spicy. Um, it says it has notes of rose and woody vanilla and pear, and, um, it smells really, it smells good, it's just not what I wear at all. This is, like... This, this is that kind of fragrance. Like this is, this is Nisha all day long. Like, mm, you know, I'm happy. This here, this is sexy. So I got this, <laughs> I got this to wear at night when I go out. Um, when I go out, uh, if I'm going to listen to music or wherever. And it's very spicy and it's very mm, feminine. So yeah, if you like that kind, if you are, it's a heavy, it's light, but it's a, it's a heavy fragrance. I don't know how to really explain it, but it smells good. Um, and I got this one at Dillard's and I don't know where I got this, but it's very, um, it's very nice and very, uh, that's my, this is my, uh, that's my fragrance. <laughs> okay. So yeah, this is C. Passione uh, by Giorgio. Okay, hey, and last but definitely not least, this is very new to me. I, this just came in the mail the other day. And um, it was a recommendation by Naturally Nisi. And I've told you guys about her before. She's like my uh, hair crush. And she's just um, a really, I just love her. Watch all her YouTube channels and everything. So it's called Lick Me All Over. And I ordered this off Amazon. It is essential body oils, courtesy of the Eyes of Horus collection. Um, so I was just trying to give this a chance. She's, she, you know, uses it or whatever. And I would say it smells like candy. It's very sweet. Um, it's very, very sweet. And it smells like candy, um, like you know, a strawberry blow pop or raspberry. It says the notes are raspberry, cantaloupe, jasmine, and violet, and um, kumquat. 
So yeah, that's what this is. And I would use this, I think, because it is a, a pheromone, it's a scented human pheromone, and it, it says that it will attract um, men. So I don't know. I, I, <laughs> she uses it. She says she uses it after she, when she gets out of the shower at, at bedtime. And I think that that would be good, especially if you have a significant other or whatever. And you just want to, you know, you don't want to really put on something heavy or you don't want to use your daytime perfume. And this is, you know, a little bit, this is a, um, a, bit, a bit much. I mean, you know, take a bath with your stuff or whatever and put on your lotion. But I think that this is kind of light and just a, a subtle fragrance. Um, so you just roll it on. And yeah, um, it, sm it does smell good. So, I mean, if you're if you're having company, maybe, I don't know if you have a significant other or if you're going out and you just put that, you know, on or whatnot, it's a pheromone. So the guys are going to come. Your milkshake's going to bring all the boys to the yard. So, yeah, these are the fragrances that I'm using for the coming of season of spring. Um, of course, the Oahu Coconut Sunset. And you can find this at Bath & Body Works. And I probably... I don't know. They they always have a sale. Maybe uh, buy three get two, and sometimes you can get buy three get three. So just check that out. Um, I'm not gonna buy any more Bath and Body Works for a long time. I've just bought 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 bought. Um, but yeah. So Bath and Body Works, Oahu Coconut Sunset, um, Coach Signature Perfume, and C Passione. Uh, by Giorgio Armani and Lick Me All Over are what Nisha is wearing for spring. Um, so if you have this or if you've used this, let me know in the comment section um, what you thought about, about those fragrances or if you're going to try them. I would really love to hear your thoughts. So those are my picks for spring 2019, probably spring going all the springs. <laughs> these fragrances get you some let me know what you think about them also if you haven't already please subscribe to the channel make sure you turn that notification bell on and if you enjoyed this video um go ahead and click that like button for me i would really appreciate it okay that's all i've got guys thank you so much for watching and until next time i'm out